two of your teammates behind, sent two up to try and gather more coins faster. Otherwise, you're going to dedicate more time, and you really want to maximize uh, your time in this world run. And there's definitely a couple coins that you definitely want to get as fast as possible through here. They're trying to get the half slides through with the chiller traps. Right now, nobody seems to have figured it out just yet, at least in the view that we're watching. But meanwhile, the Fish Fam and the Sunshine Soldiers are up to 13 now, but still, I believe all teams are now inside of the castle, and we call this basically the first kind of tier of the difficulty for these obstacles. As they move up and go past this, they will become progressively harder. Yeah, and, and again, this is the first time these creative players qualifiers have seen the world run. They've never seen it before. They have just, you know, they are mad. There Their is. skills are insane. And look at this, Taldex already up on the next tier. See, he's probably telling his teammates, all right, look, up here, I just used this bumper. What do I have to do? See, he's already trying to figure it out. I like it. That's not me. The moment I hit that pad, I was like, I guess I just keep moving forward. And I, I, love this. I love this experimentation. He's actually also communicating back to his teammate at the same time because he went over that bumper and he's looking. Do I have an opportunity to go back here? Or is this it? Do I have to go forward? Yep. Just like you were alluding to before. And now he decides, okay, he tells what exactly what's going on to his teammates, Ninja, Kaz, and company, and they move forward. Alex JJ, though, is off to. He's, he's way ahead of everybody else, I think, but no, there's a rare revenge. No, it's Phenos, it's his team. Boom. They are moving. So what's, what's tricky about that last jump there is the, those little uh, directional pads will give you forward momentum, but in jumping you lose some of it. So you actually have to make it in a straight run. There you have to trigger the trap, get the impulse to make that precise jump, land on the other side, trigger the trap in one fail swoop, while also taking a step back to keep yourself safe. Now there is a little few... Uh, secret ways to kind of trigger certain traps or get around certain obstacles. We'll have to see if these players discover them. But like you said, man, Spenos is oh my goodness. destroying the Spenos. game right now. Just unbelievable. And this isn't even a team that qualified from a death run or elimination run or even a speed run. They qualified from a survival map. And he's doing things like this. He is leading the pack. There's a fish fam up ahead of him, though. Yep. They're not hitting this just yet. This is so precise. You have to change the altitude. Is he going to hit it? No. Second try. Here's Suzo. There you go. First jump. Now, this is the impulse that's going to send you a little bit forward. Now, this is one where you want to get height. You got to throw it, try to get on top of it. No. Just barely Suzo. And he's at 21 points right now in third in terms of coins. And it's all up to timing, I think. Zeke, we might see this end in the first match, in the first round, they might end up completing everything because they still got five minutes to go. Well, we'll see, Bala, because here's the thing. That that obstacle there is called the ice jump. But this next one that Four Turtle is at, uh, we call this the double danger. Let's just look at this real fast. Uh, this he is really tricky. It. He already knows. He, he, he's already downloaded. He already knows. Double, hop, double bunny hop, land on the edge, take a step back, trigger the trap without being eliminated, right? Then you can walk up this small ramp. Then, depending on how you want to go about it, you can just go forward. Yes. He actually makes. Okay, I'm a third okay. try. I'm leaving. I'm done. But one thing, we have to look at the scores right now. Five minutes to go. Fish Fam is at 26. They only have four coins remaining. But everybody else is starting to like fall behind. We're starting to see the Fish Fam come way out above here of the rest of them. That's because they probably have the majority of their players through. The majority of the players are collecting those coins. There's four turtles. It makes it through the double danger. Collects the coin. Now, what do you do from here? They get up. Man, this guy is absolutely insane. Is. And you know, for four, uh, four turtles, it's funny because he's just excited about being here, able to compete on the stage for like thousands of people in all these years. And bro, he is just slaying it right now. Oh, you gotta be careful. Okay, all right, yep. Everything's fine. Now you're gonna make the jump. You got the one hop. You gotta be careful. <gasps> that is. Gotcha. That Get is in trap, baby. That is the first time I've seen that. I've seen the theory. I mean, I've heard it theorized, but I haven't seen that yet. But Fish Fam, I was wondering. It's Scissors and Company. 26 points. They're not at the same point that the Sunshine Soldiers are at, but they're at 26 total. The entire team. They have clearly synergized with Scissors here, but looks to be that even the Ravens Revenge are stuck at 26, so this might be a difficult one to get past. Yeah, this this one, so the tricky bit about this one is there's actually no checkpoint in between here and where you need to get to. That's what makes the double danger that double dangerousness. 
26 points top, and there's only about three minutes left. These guys really have to focus up, try to get through. Now the key thing going forward is again, this is a, a test of speed, right? So a lot of these players are seeing the traps, they're making it through, memorizing kind of what they have to be doing to make it through. The obstacle Dan's already through, and that means when they get to come through next time, it's gonna be that much faster, right? They're gonna be just tearing through all of these obstacles like they're nothing. And Blood, Lachlan, here we go. There's Lachlan captains. Oh, hey, this oh. is this is important too because they still have coins to earn on their own. Right. They're they're you know. They're all the way in the back. They're not earning the coins. They're not helping their team out in front, trying to figure out the obstacles, but two captains back there. Ooh. Okay. All right, trade the other one. Yes. All right. Land on it. Is he going to get it? Nice dodge. Ooh. This is insane right now. And there's the second player to make it through for Turtle. Into the door. No. No. Nope. And look, you have to you drop back down. So that's the challenging part. We call this thread the needle, right? You have to make it in one go. This is extremely extremely difficult, and this is where a lot of these players are going to get caught up, but Turtle is a legend. Look at how methodical he is. He's insane. Look at these wow. the precision jumps, man. He's not going to miss this ever again because he already knows that trap, unfortunately, was timed at the wrong time for Crytax, but he's up above. Let's see what he can do here going to try this again. Trap above. And he lands on that at the right moment and slow himself down for Turtle from up above. Still back. Nobody has passed this point just yet. Pop across, take a step back. Nice. Step across, take another step back. Okay. He was trying to be a little greedy. I respect that. You know, you want sometimes just want to land on that without having to kind of hop back out and kind of just risking that. So it's good that, you know, well, it's not good. It's bad that he messed it up, but it's okay. This is Turtle. about to figure this out. He got up here before, and he didn't make it through the door. He's not going to make it again. Fortunately, everybody is hard stuck at 27 coins with one minute left, I believe. Whoever is going to be the first to make it through here might find themselves the first winners on the world run. One minute left.